All right, today we're very happy to introduce the next installment in our Behind the Icons series. Today we'll be exploring those beautiful golden skyscrapers near the ORU campus. Ted Reeds with the Tulsa Foundation for Architecture takes us on a tour. Good morning and welcome to Good Day Tulsa for our seventh in a series of Behind the Icons in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Today we're out south at the uh, Cityplex Towers, formerly known as the City of Faith, uh, designed uh, through a vision of the founder, Oral Roberts, of Oral Roberts University, of a medical facility originally envisioned to be 777 feet tall. The FDA, unfortunately, because it's in the flight path, put some uh, value engineering quite early on it, so it ended up 638 feet tall. It is still at 60 stories, the tallest by stories structure in the city of Tulsa. In height, it's only outmaneuvered by the BOK Tower by 19 feet. Designed by Frank Wallace in a style that has slowly become known as God Mod. Uh, due to the nature of the curriculum and the nature uh, of what they practice here. This building, through Oral's vision, uh, was to attack three sicknesses, cancer, aging, and heart disease. And those three uh, tenants uh, were what this, this whole facility is built upon. Groundbreaking occurred for the City of Faith on January 24th, 1978, which coincidentally was Oral Roberts' 60th birthday. He broke ground before he had approval from the State Department of Health. Uh, there was some uh, noise about, we have already too many hospital beds in Tulsa when he built this. But Oral stood his ground and, and quietly uh, moved ahead and in an interview with ABC in March of 1978, he had full confidence that the whole complex would be approved by Health and Human Services of the state of Oklahoma. Three towers are part of this complex. They make up over two million square feet. As a combined edifice, single edifice, they are the largest poured in place concrete structure west of the Mississippi River. The towers were to hold this. The 60-story building was built in Oral's words as a referral center uh, for patients coming in and getting looked at. The 20-story was for working with science in a clinical setting, and the 30-story tower was for a 777-bed hospital. Here we stand on the 60th floor looking out the windows. This height connects us to the river and to the river symbolically flows the healing waters. It really is a beautiful view. You feel like you're part of the heavens up here. So Oral was really the first to declare the prosperity gospel. In the 1950s on his radio show, he promised for every dollar you contributed, you would get a return seven times over in heaven. So began in my opinion, his fascination with the number seven, 777 feet tall. In front, going to the north, was a 777 foot long river that culminated along 81st Street with the prayer hands. 777 beds. While never completed, it was still symbolic uh, to him and to his followers. This building has survived because like other good buildings that are built with good bones and a good soul, it's adapted to a new beginning and a new existence. And that is of partially a surgical hospital, a lot of office space, uh, and various other occupancies. So it has adapted to the times. When Oral had this built, he hoped that his hospital would last forever. In the end, while his hospital did not last, the building has. And here at 39 years and going on 40 years, this joins the legacy of icons in Tulsa that we proudly call our own. And now you know.
pretty interesting, right? As you can see, Oral Roberts believed the number seven very spiritually significant. He based a lot of his designs for the Cityplex Towers around the numbers we just saw. And although we didn't plan it this way, it just so happens that was the seventh installment in our Behind the Icon series. Hey, if you want to visit the Cityplex Towers yourself, they're located at 2488 East 81st Street. You can also call 918-493-8888 or visit their website at cityplextowers.com. For more information about the architectural icons in Tulsa, you can visit tulsaarchitecture.org.